Welcome to Comrade Media, the 4th of July, American Independence Day. The 4th of July, also known as Independence Day, has been a federal holiday in the United States since 1941. But the tradition of Independence Day celebrations goes back to the 18th century and the American Revolution. On July 2, 1776, the Continental Congress voted in favor of independence and two days later, delegates from the 13 colonies adopted the Declaration of Independence, a historic document drafted by Thomas Jefferson. From 1776 to the present day, July 4th has been celebrated as the birth of American independence with festivities ranging from fireworks, parades and concerts to more casual family gatherings and barbecues. The 4th of July 2021 is on Sunday, July 4th. The federal holiday will be observed on Monday, July 5th, 2021. A history. When the initial battles in the Revolutionary War broke out in April 1775, few colonists desired complete independence from Great Britain and those who did were considered radical. By the middle of the following year, however, many more colonists had come to favor independence thanks to the growing hostility against Britain and the spread of revolutionary sentiments such as those expressed in the best-selling pamphlet Common Sense. It was published by Thomas Paine in early 1776. On June 7, when the Continental Congress met the Pennsylvania State House, later called the Independence Hall, in Philadelphia, the Virginia delegate Richard Henry Lee introduced a motion calling for the colony's independence. Amid heated debate, Congress postponed the vote on Lee's resolution but appointed a five-man committee including Thomas Jefferson, John Adams, Roger Sherman, Benjamin Franklin and Robert L. Livingston. They were appointed to draft a formal statement justifying the break with Great Britain. On July 2nd, the Continental Congress voted in favor of Lee's resolution for independence in a near unanimous vote. On that day, John Adams wrote to his wife Abigail Lee that July 2nd will be celebrated by succeeding generations as the great anniversary festival and that the celebration should include pomp and parade, games, sports, guns, bells, bonfires and illumination from one end of this continent to the other. On July 4th, Continental Congress formally adopted the Declaration of Independence which had been written largely by Jefferson. Though the vote for actual independence took place on July 2nd, from then on, 4th became the day that was celebrated as the birth of American independence. Early 4th of July celebrations in the pre-revolutionary years, colonists had held annual celebrations of the king's birthday, which traditionally included the ringing of bells, bonfires, processions and speech making. By contrast, during the summer of 1776, some colonists celebrated the birth of independence by holding mock funerals for the King George III as a way of symbolizing the end of monarchy's hold on America and the triumph of liberty. Festivities including concerts, bonfires, parades and firing of cannons and muskets usually accompanied the first public readings of the Declaration of Independence, beginning immediately after its adoption. Philadelphia held the first annual commemoration of independence on July 4th, 1777, while Congress was still occupied with the ongoing war. George Washington issued double rations of rum to all his soldiers to mark anniversary of independence in 1778 and in 1781. And hence, July 4th was officially made the state holiday. After the Revolutionary War, Americans continued to commemorate Independence Day every year in celebrations that allowed the new nation's emerging political leaders to address citizens and create a feeling of unity. By the last decade of the 18th century, the two major political parties, the Federalist Party and Democratic Republicans that had arisen began holding separate 4th of July celebrations in many large cities. The tradition of setting of fireworks on the 4th of July began in Philadelphia on July 4, 1777 during the first organized celebration of Independence Day. The tradition of patriotic celebration became even more worshipped after the War of 1812 in which the United States again faced Great Britain. In 1870, the US Congress made July 4 a federal holiday. In 1941, the provision was expanded to grant a paid holiday to all federal employees. The most common symbol of the holiday is the American flag, 
and a common musical accompaniment is the star spangled banner the national anthem of the united states there is an interesting fact it is an interesting fact of american history that the founding father presidents john adams thomas jefferson and james monroe died on july 4th on the independence day anniversary 